Explosive power is the key to achieving the bar muscle up. But even if you have been training normal pull ups for years, it doesn't translate to the kind of explosive power you need for muscle ups. Let's dive deeper into explosive pull ups and the most common mistakes I see when trying to build explosive power. If you are a beginner and just starting out your muscle up journey and want to learn the right technique from the beginning, I would recommend getting my free muscle up checklist where I explain all the steps towards achieving the muscle up. It has helped a lot of my students understanding the muscle up technique. You can download it by clicking on the link in the description below. The first mistake I often see when working on the explosive pull up is pulling with the wrong technique. The most common mistake when training explosive pull ups is that we are trying to apply our normal pull up technique to our explosive pull ups. Let me explain. The purpose of training explosive pull ups is to achieve the muscle up as the end goal. Therefore, we need to change our pulling technique. Instead of pulling your elbows back like in normal pull-ups, you are pulling with your elbows in front of you. Use whatever resistance band combination you need to touch the bar under your chest or lower in each and every repetition. The second most common mistake is to not rest enough between each set. To be able to be explosive, we have to train up the so-called fast twitch muscle fibers. Fast twitch muscle fibers provide bigger and more powerful forces, but for shorter durations and fatigue very quickly. This means that we have to train fewer repetitions with longer rest between sets. A common mistake is not resting long enough between each set and not recovering enough to be able to maximize the potential of each set. For explosive pull-ups, I recommend resting 5 minutes between each set. In my experience, this will make you achieve the muscle up much faster, even though it might feel like you're wasting your time resting for that long. Use the resting time to work on your mobility, like opening up your hips, thoracic spine, or any other mobility drill you need to work on. The third mistake is looking for fast results. Don't rush the process. Upper body explosiveness is what takes the most time to achieve in my experience. So don't think that you are doing something wrong if your results are slow. Train your explosive pull-ups two times per week at the most. Training them more won't make you progress any faster, but will just set you up for injuries down the line. And as I mentioned before, if you are a beginner and want to learn the muscle up or feel stuck in your muscle up journey, I would recommend using my muscle up technique checklist before every muscle up workout as a reminder of the technique. This will make you learn the muscle up much faster and safer. Download it by clicking on the link in the description below. Have a great day and I see you in the next one.